Hey YouTube, it's Juan here again with another side-by-side -side creamy comparison. Uh, today I'm doing eggnog and uh, I, I wanted to try out this Califia uh, holiday nog that I heard about um, against what the way I've been doing like uh, you know kind of like a DIY a low calorie eggnog, fake eggnog, because there's eggless eggnog, whatever you want to call it. Uh, just using my, you know, regular base recipe of almond milk, uh, cottage cheese, guar gum, sweetener, um, and then I use vanilla protein powder. But then for the flavoring, I uh, add rum extract, nutmeg, and cinnamon. And uh, first time I tried that, I was like, wow, that really tastes like, uh, has that eggnog type flavor. And um, I compared it to... Um, True Teen has a eggnog protein powder that I, I liked also, and uh, it was pretty much the same type of flavor. So I was like, okay, I can just do this myself without buying an extra protein powder. So I've never tried doing a creamy with like an actual eggnog, um, you know, milk or product. So, cause, because they're so high calorie, you know, eggnogs, like traditional eggnogs, very high, you know, calorie, calorie dense, fat and carbs, a lot of sugar and fat. So this is a, a low calorie version. Uh, having said that, for 50 calories for four ounces, that's basically the like equivalent of 100 calories per cup compared to 30 calories per cup of this. So it's still a lot more calories than, you know, a traditional um, anabolic creamy the way I like to do it. So you know, to compare the calories for this creamy, the way, you know, my low calorie one is 229 calories for the entire pint with 38 grams of protein, seven carbs and six grams of fat. This one is over hundred calories extra. So it's 323 calories, you know, pretty much same protein, 39 protein, but it's got 30 grams of carbs. And that's because this uses, um, sugar it's uh you know it's sweetened with sugar so there's your carbs and uh seven grams of fat so a similar fat just one more gram but really it's the extra sugar that uh, you know makes this higher calories so uh so let's see if it's if it's worth it you know how it tastes compared to mine and uh see if it's worth the extra 100 calories per pint and uh i'll include the the whole recipe um, later in the video. Uh, they look the same consistency wise. I took a picture and I included it in the video. So let's give it a shot. So I'll try mine first. Really good consistency, thick, not icy. I use a whey casein protein. I use the Quest vanilla protein. One of my favorites, um, especially for creamies, for both, both of them. So this is this one just uses this without any extra flavoring, and again, this is almond milk with this flavoring. So that's so good. I love this. Yeah, it definitely has a eggnog type flavor. So let's see. Uh, with this Califia eggnog version is. So again, this was just this milk, same amount as, as I used as this one, which I had 11 ounces for the pint. And then just the cottage cheese, the guar gum, sweetener, half the sweetener is this one, because this is already sweetened. But there's, I didn't add any extra flavoring, so there's just the flavoring of the milk, the eggnog milk. It's really good. They're both delicious.
I think they're both tied on flavor, to be honest with you. So, this one may have a hint. I noticed reading the label, the ingredients, they include, um, in addition to nutmeg, they also include ginger. So I did not include ginger in mine. I kind of taste a, a little hint of ginger in this. But, other than that, it's pretty much the same flavor. Obviously, I could add ginger to this if I... Maybe I'll try that next time. A little bit of ginger, but... Powdered ginger. I mean, they're both delicious. But I don't think that I would... Get this one again, because... Um, number one, it's, you know, for an extra 100 calories. Like, for the, the same quality of taste, I can just do this one for less calories. Much less sugar. It's also cheaper, too, because this is just generic almond milk from Walmart compared to this Colifia, you know, premium eggnog. So, anyways, this, but this, I would give this a great review, though. It's, all, it's really tasty. And, uh, I think. If you like eggnog, you'd like it, especially compared to, it's still much lower calorie than other eggnogs, so. but yeah, so I'm going to stick with my DIY version. So, hope this helps, and uh, until next time, bye.